Hello and welcome to the brand new edition of Personal Presents Colors Food Trail Season 4 powered by Life Boy in association with Panadol, Pana Natural, Centrum, Nair, Jif, Al Baker, Caperson and Al Osra. New recipes, new stories, new personalities with your brand new host Yachna. I'm here to take you on unforgettable culinary journeys crafted to perfection by our grand old chef, Habs. So who's our first guest? Well, it's a name that will live through ages. But he has made a name for himself. So let's welcome him to our episode. Hi, I'm Maradona Rubello. I was born during the 1986 World Cup and that's how I got my name. I grew up in Bombay. I did my college from St. Xavier's in advertising and journalism. From there on, I went to do a couple of ads, the Close Up Pasa Ona campaign being the famous. I've also done a film titled Punk with the Pasha Basu as the main lead. I came close to doing films like Slumdog Millennia, Life of Pi. And uh, right now I'm in Dubai. I love to travel. I'm also a travel influencer. And yes, I'm happy to be here with you today. So Chef, we have our first guest, who's a presenter, actor, multi-talented, modeling bhi karte hai. And I think, he can actually say ki naam to suna ho ga. Itne saare talent hai, cooking to nahi karte na? No, no, no. Otherwise, you have to shift the position, shift the position. Let me be a guest sometime, please. Yeah, that's your masterclass. Yeah, okay. But seriously, such a cool profession that you have, it makes you travel also so much. True. And but I want to know that has your name made you travel or helped you travel to a city that you didn't think? Yes, it has. In fact, uh, when Argentina won the World Cup, yeah, I was invited by the city of Naples. Mm -hmm. It's a city that it's a beautiful uh, city in Italy. Mm -hmm. uh, it's the place where they celebrate Diego Maradona. Yes, yes. I was invited by a few properties. Uh, I was invited by a very famous chef. I got to learn how to make the original margarita pizza. Wow. Okay. So yeah, that that my name has definitely helped me. I can say that. Some yes. experience, huh? All thanks to my dad, but. <laughs> and my name only takes me to the gym. Oh! <laughs> Abhijit, AB. Abs. Look at him, <laughs> Chef he's, Abs. He's one of the fittest chefs that I've seen. <laughs> my job is to make sure that you don't get abs. Oh! Okay, so eat a lot. So okay? you keep the name? <laughs> to feed you, to feed you guys, okay? <laughs> Perfect. But so much of travel, I'm sure there must have been uh, some cities that uh, struck a special chord. Yes, absolutely. I mean, uh, Mumbai, mm -hmm. where I come from. Oh my from. god, Amchi Mumbai. Idhar ka, uh, idhar ka connection hai. Bye. Amchi Mumbai, <laughs> yes. like he said it, right? Uh, I love Jaipur, mm -hmm. uh, Dubai, okay. Okay. Hong Kong and of course, uh, Italy always remains a favourite. So many cities and itta sara khana. Because, dekho, khana is one major part of travel. I agree. At least, it's meri leto part of life. Of course. Yeah, absolutely. So, absolutely. any favourite dishes? Yes, uh, so Sunday ritual back home. Is Goan chicken curry. Oh. oh. You know what? I was in Goa in six months uh, yeah. working there, and every morning I used to have that Goan pa with kafriel. Yes. Ah. So we have so many connections. Oh, yes. We do. you like Jaipur? Yes, I do. Okay, Rana. <laughs> so we have three connections now. Mm. It's yes. going to be easy. Yeah. So Goan chicken curry on Sundays, uh, samosa, my mm. all time comfort food. Yeah. If I'm extremely happy, I'm extremely sad. Samosa is the answer. Okay. okay. I like uh, lasagna. And of course, uh, back home, uh, masala dosa kind of struck a chord with me. And of course, I like uh, edamame truffle dumplings okay. and oh. arancini. Arancini, okay. Yes, my favorite. Italian it's Christian. It's a lambi list. Aa hai. Yeah, I hope I, think I, hope I have not given you a. We do want to know, do you have a sweet tooth? Do you have yes, I do. Uh, there have to be a few favourites. Moti Chur Laddu. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Uh, tiramisu. Ghee Wali. Yes. Yeah. Tiramisu. Hmm. And... Uh, you bar bar Italian, bar bar Italian. Ja rahe like connection. <laughs> yeah, oh. We will come Somewhere. back to that. <laughs> I don't know how. <laughs> and Kunafa. So any festivals that were special? Holi, mm -hmm. uh, Cherry Blossom Festival. Oh. Uh, recently I went, I got a chance to be at the Oktoberfest. 
and uh, there's a beautiful festival in Italy again. It's called uh, the Festival of Pizzocchi. Mm. Never heard of this. Yes. I've not. Buckwheat uh, pasta, butter, huh. and a special cheese. So that's Pazera. there, like in a buckwheat pasta, one day of dieting kind of pasta thing, you know, buckwheat pasta. <laughs> no, but it's 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 two extreme combinations: yeah, buckwheat pasta, uh, and? butter, mm. and there's a che specific cheese called cazera. Cazera. Yeah. Oh. So I just now have to ask you if there has to be any favorite art theme, Ooh. if you had to pick. You've traveled so much, so there has to be. I think a combination of. Simplistic and passionate is in the Italian style. Ooh. Italian, for sure. I love Italian food. By Better half be वहीं से है. बोलना ही पड़ेगा. Wow. इसीलिए हर जगह Italian ही आ रहा है. Italian. वो लोग ये ऐसे ऊपर से नीचे Italian ही आ रहा है. इन चीज़ों को ये लाओ, वो लाओ. मैं सोच रहा हूँ क्या हो रहा है. Italian आ रहा है. क्यों आ रहा है? अभी पता चला. Special connection. Raz खुलने वाला है. लेकिन if somebody has to decode your personality, three colors that come to your mind. Blue, hmm. orange, hmm. and yellow. Interesting. And he's not wearing any one of them. Yeah, because the set has all these colors. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so, chef, are you cooking in your brain already? Done, already ready. Uh, just oh. need some time to start setting up. Just need some time. Yes. <laughs> So as you heard, बस थोड़ा सा टाइम लेंगे लेकिन बहुत जल्दी वापस आएंगे सो टेक अ शॉर्ट ब्रेक वेलकम बैक टू पर्सनल प्रेजेंट कलर्स फूड ट्रेल सीजन फोर Powered by Life Boy, in association with Panadol, Pana Natural, Centrum, Nair, Jif, Al Baker, by Lida and Batiste. So, Chef, have you already, you know, prepared to take us on this journey? Yes. And the whole map is ready. I'm sure. The whole map is ready. As you can see, wale? the ingredients are there. Hmm. So now I've taken all the feedback. What hmm. he likes, what he loves, where he travels, food, everything, memories, wife, Italian. <laughs> Blah blah blah. <laughs> Which food was it? Yes. Yes. So what Ooh. we doing today? Hmm. Uh, I'm cooking first dish, which is going to be an uh, almond crusted edamame samosa. Oh. Usually. Samosa love. Uh, you, samosa love. Uh, today he's happy to be yes. here with us. <laughs> yes, I'm sure. <laughs> and enjoy some. So, food. I'm going to make the samosa with edamame and crusted with almond. Okay. Normally, hmm. samosa you make with the dough, yeah. but I want to skip that part. So give something different. Oh, yeah, some twist to it. So I'm gonna just crush it with almond. So give a nice crunch with almond. Okay. The second dish, and obviously, hmm. is Italian love. Of course. We have to bring it here. We have. Otherwise, to. he will go home, and his wife <laughs> gonna say, "What? No, no. We let's bring Italy Italian. here. Yes. Yeah, hmm. So let's bring Italy here. So for Italian one, I'm gonna make the arancini. He loves football. He relate himself with the uh, Maradona. Mm -hmm. So I want to bring that football kind of thing to give a look and feel of football to the arancini. Obviously, some twist and turn that's going to come after we cook it. You will see. Mm -hmm. Want to keep it suspense. Uh, he's from Goa. Yes. So, Goan chicken curry. Oh. Okay. So I want to add that to the arancini. So arancini going to have a Goan chicken curry stuffing okay. with some truffle, mm -hmm. mushrooms, and some black aioli sauce. Wow. Wow, that's, that's a, lot a lot of inputs. I'm yes. really excited Ooh. to see what really comes out. Yeah. Let's get cooking. <laughs> okay, you need to chop some things for me. Oh yes, yes. <laughs> yes. No way, no. Here, I'm the only one. We won't one. make you cry. Yeah. We won't give you onions to chop. So we'll sure. start with the first one, which is an edamame mm -hmm. uh, samosa with almond crusted. Mm -hmm. Because for that one, I'm just gonna take some oil. शेफ आपको देख के तो लगता नहीं है कि ये कोई सवाल करेगा भी बट आई वुड लाइक टू नो यू दैट यू नो बोथ ऑफ यू आर सो फिट बट बिकॉज सिंस ही इज हियर एंड ही इज शेफ एब्स Yeah, <laughs> and you are the guest, so we have to ask you, not me. <laughs> But he's very fit. I, I want to know this from you. That how do you uh, like stay fit and uh, you know manage with all this travel and going to different locations and different weather conditions? I think a good uh, tip. Is not to stay hungry. Have mm -hmm. your meals on time. Mm. Yeah. And if I really don't have a meal uh, ready for me, mm. I always have some spirulina with me. It's okay. almost like a meal replacement. Yes. 
high but, protein. Yes. yes. Yeah. But not never tasty. <laughs> Yeah, uh, not tasty. anything which is healthy is. Oh. Yeah, I would say that I'm a chef. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you could come up with something that's tasty and yeah, healthy. I'm sure I'll make way. it tasty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I think yeah, never skipping your meals. Mm. And uh, yeah, back home, mom would always make me some honey and ginger and. Yeah, little, sardi uh, zukam. So yeah, it's like I think common with every weather change. Yeah, so just about uh, not skipping your meals mostly. And I think that's great. Actually, everybody must take care of how, what they eat. And True. Clean eating always helps. Yeah. And while we can always build in the practice of eating right when the weather or climate changes, our body reacts in various ways. Or pe kabi sardi, kabi khansi, kabi zukam. So one of the solution definitely is Panatural cough syrup from the makers of Panadol, with a triple action formula that smooths, soothes, and shields your throat. It helps you fight back both wet and dry cough, allowing you to enjoy your day. We are waiting for this dish to be enjoyed. Let's start. What's cooking? What's cooking? What's cooking? <laughs> <laughs> I hope I can do that, but now I need to start cooking. <laughs> All right. So, obviously, we're making samosa. So, we're going to start with some Indian spices. Mm -hmm. First, I'm going to put some cumin here. I hope the oil is hot. It's getting hot. Some garlic, uh, garlic here, chopped garlic. Okay. All right, here I'm adding some edamame beans. Okay. Okay, now I have here, have you tried Jerusalem artichoke before? Yes. They're very smoky taste, they're very nice. Okay. They, they're close to potatoes. But they are like in um, elite potatoes. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna miss them here. Some chopped coriander. Mm. Jagat favorite aloo. I'm gonna add this one here. Now it's cooled down a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm gonna make this samosa shape. Ooh. Okay. Wow. The love triangle that you love. <laughs> the love triangle. Ye agar aap aise rakh do, koi bhi kha sakta. Chef, you're the art and the artist. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you. All right, from Italy. Let's fly down to Goa. <laughs> All right. So we have uh, chicken curry, which is Goan chicken curry. As I told you earlier, mm -hmm. I'm going to infuse with darancini. Okay. So I have there's lots of ingredients here. I will start with some oil, okay. coconut oil. I'm going to add some curry leaves. In like Maradona, who do you prefer, Maradona or Messi? Or Ronaldo, I'll give you all three options so that I don't <laughs> really course. upset anyone. Of course, there's this name. It has to be. Yeah, it has to be Maradona. <laughs> but yeah. The, Otherwise, your father will kill you. <laughs> yeah, no, but even Messi is exceptionally, mm. equally. So you're a Messi there. fan? Yeah, I am. Hmm. I'm going to add some spices. Okay. okay. Some coriander powder, some cumin powder. Chef, either or cooking or eating? Cooking first. Yeah? Yeah. Eating always next. Kimchi or pickles? Kimchi. Ooh. I used to be a pickles fan all my life, I think, but now I've started loving kimchi a lot more. And also started making kimchi. So. Oh. Take some chicken. This is chicken thigh. I'm gonna put it here. Today feels like Sunday for me. <laughs> this is my staple Sunday meal. Okay. Oh. So like and I've not had it in a long time. Now that I've shifted to the UAE. You cook it or you order it? Oh yeah, I order it. <laughs> okay. But back home, mom makes it. Okay. So now you reminded me of home. <laughs> I think some fragrances mm. can actually transport you. Yeah. I, I really Absolutely. believe that. I think the plate is calling me. <laughs> Here, I'm going to add coconut milk. And let it simmer hey, for some coconut time. Coconut milk, jo halat aur jazbat badle hai. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now it's the... Ooh. Yeah. 
I added a bit of salt here. It's almost making me sing Goan songs now. Ah, then sing Go it. Go for it. Dear Mama, I love. Ani khati pona lip lo. Dear Baba, I love. Ani khati pona lip lo. Ani bazar itza pila lagi kill ba di da ka. Yo yo Maya yo. Yo yo Maya yo. Yo yo Maya yo. Yo yo Maya yo. You like a Remo? Chef has brought Goa to the yes. UAE. Chicken curry is ready. Uh -huh. Yep. Now next is arancini. Wow. So what I have done here, I previously cooked this one already. The rice is there. This is aquarel rice. Okay. Some truffle inside. Okay. Oh, already. Okay. Lots of Parmesan cheese, Parmigiano Reggiano. <laughs> All right. So now arancini, we're going to take the rice, squeeze it a little bit, make a pocket here. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Take this chicken. A little bit of sauce. Stuffing. Yeah. He's yes. really uh, blended. Everything. Not just India and Italy. He's taken it down to Goa and yes, <laughs> he, region he, in Italy. Yes, he really listened to all the details. Yeah. I'm going to dip it. This is flour. Okay. And Dip it in an egg. Okay. Now, here I am using panko breadcrumbs. So, the samosa that we made earlier, mm -hmm. we're going to fry it now. Ready. Mm. Now time to plate. Yeah. But before that, as you can see, my apron is so dirty. Yeah. I'm a messy chef. Not like a messy messy, <laughs> but a messy, messy chef. Okay. But why so bother need... about like the stains, the haldi stains? Yeah. I mean, I need to change it. It doesn't look nice. True. Yeah, but we got a solution for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. So the number one liquid detergent we have for stain removers, and that is Purcell Power Gel. You know what? It's a great idea, but do you think that these will these stains will go with that? Absolutely. Purcell Power Gel is truly number one in stain removal thanks to its deep clean technology. Its advanced German formula removes even the toughest stains with ease to ensure perfect cleanliness and freshness. Purcell Power Gel is definitely the modern way of washing. Then here you go. See, no more stains. Indeed. Only long lasting freshness with every wash. Now your magic is done. Now it's our turn. As you can see, plates are ready. Hmm. Yes. They are nice, white and simple. Yes. As you mentioned, he loves simple art. Yes. Okay, with the passion. Uh -huh. It's here anyway. <laughs> <laughs> you like Italian. And so Colossum can... yep. is there. Alps, you like love Milan. Yes. Oh. So it's there. No and we're yeah. going to make this beautiful plating now. We'll start. With the arancini for arancini. The attention to detail is amazing. Yeah, the so, stage is set. Yes. The Alps had this black and white structure, and this is again a oh. football net. Whoa! Okay. Yeah, think... the details have won my heart. Yeah, yeah I, Chef, I don't think. Taste to baad mein karenge. Ye dekhne mein iti gorgeous. Oh. So now, as you can see, where we started hmm. and where we ended. Brilliant. This is the first we ended time. Brilliant, seriously. Someone's really heard me, and to put that into your passion of cooking and presenting a dish, thank you so much. I think uh, more than that, a jadu ki jhappi. Oh, oh, this is the moment. <laughs> it's a beautiful uh, presentation of all my thoughts. Yeah. Into food, and yeah, I can't wait to dig in. Please. Here it is. Which one Chef. should I go for first? Uh, I mean. Which one? 
Ali, samosa is your love. Oh, yes. go for it. On the right, from the middle. This net just looks incredible at the backdrop. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. I'm gonna wow. need some <laughs> to take away. <laughs> yeah, it's actually turned out so, uh, so unique. Tasty. You get it's the nice smoky taste. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You feel that smokiness from you the. You really have to artist. taste this Absolutely. to believe and it. And the crunch of the almond layer yeah. is just epic. Yeah, I mean you can't it's describe yummy. it, but it's it's beautiful. It's time for the arancini. Gonna have it like a real Italian. Ooh. Ooh. Dash of pesto. No, no, Gold Gappe ki tarah full has to go. Oh, transported. Yes. The Goan chicken curry. Yeah. Mm. Is a perfect combo. One's from Italy, one's from Goa. Truffle inside it. And with the sauce. Brilliant chef. Oh my god, I'm in Goa right now. See you guys later. <laughs> I think this Italian love story, we tasted and it was great, but uh, it is time for a break. But we are not done yet with you two because now we have to do it. So stay with us, don't go anywhere. Welcome back to Purcell Presents Colors Food Trail Season 4. Powered by Lifebuoy in association with Panadol, Pananatural, Centrum, Nair, Jif, Al Baker, Flawless, and Haldirams. And now you have a sweet tooth. Yes. And I want to ask, do you have a sweet tooth? Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Just someone eats Moti Chur Laddu. Of course. Has to be sweet. Tooth. Of course. Okay. So what we so, have here, yes. now we're going to start the plating. I have these two types of cherries because he loved the Japanese uh, cherry festival. Cherry. Oh. So I, this is a cherry tree. I have these cherry, one made from the tiramisu and one made from motichur laddu. Really? Yes. So what are we going to do? I think now Japan is yeah. going to be making it. So we're trip. going to hang them here on the tree. So I want to know like why particularly cherry blossom festival? Why do you like it? It happens during a specific period of time, just mm -hmm. before spring. And as a kid, I always wanted to experience this, uh, the whole cherry blossom festival in its it full splendor. And what Chef is doing right now is something uh, <laughs> unimaginable it to the next level. Really, I I couldn't have imagined that he would interpret your thoughts and likings. Is, right now, wow. he's gone like full sci-fi Christopher Nolan mode. In uh, don't disturb me. Oh, I'm yeah. just focusing on these one. <laughs> you will be very soon in Japanese food heaven. <laughs> I think the look of this tree is gonna be like awesome. Yeah, I just want to lie down below that tree and. By the way, there's gonna be Motichu Laddu on the uh, bed of this tree, so you can lie down. Wow! Your, with wow. your love of Motichu Laddu. Okay. Now you will be in sweet heaven for sure. Some are fallen here. Ooh. You know, you often see those people who can't share their dessert. Like Joey doesn't share food, <laughs> and some people don't share their dessert. But I think if this is the dessert presented, nobody would like to share. I think Chef was one of those people that sat below a tree like Einstein and had the ah, apple fall apple down apple. and he invented the <laughs> equation and yes. he's getting all his ideas. Which tree do you sit, uh, Chef? Usually on Monday, <laughs> <A> Tuesdays? <mango>. <laughs> <laughs> where, where do these ideas come from? I mean, these ideas come from you guys because you take us to the next level, you challenge us and that's how we create the thing. You've oh really taken God, the look at that. Wow. Your favorite Motichur Laddu. Yeah. That I'm gonna put under this tree so you can lie down on this bed. Oh. This is like a dream, yeah? Absolutely. You really incorporated the yellow favorite color again. Yes, this is orange like, and yellow. Forget. This is like Inception. <laughs> The dream inside a dream. Dream within a dream. <laughs> so okay. true. Now the magic time. Yes. Okay. Magic time, okay? Okay. Don't worry, the foam will come, yeah? The smoke will come now. There you go. One, two, three. Whoa. 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 Spectacular. Time to eat. Okay, wait a second. You don't okay. need a spoon for this oh, one. Oh, of course. Okay. Whoa. Give you. 
this you one. You can pick your own fruits, as they say, when you're in a farm. Cheers with cherries. Cheers with cherries. How do you pull you? And chef, I'm going to have the moti chur one now. Yes. <laughs> oh. Hmm. The heart is happy now. <laughs> Great. <laughs> I didn't expect actually there will be like different flavors, but that was a surprise. You want the moti chur to try? That was a surprise. No, no I'm okay. good. But thank you so much. So I want to know, Maradona, mm -hmm. how was the love affair today? <laughs> oh, it was incredible. This whole. Uh, trio of dishes and the way he's innovated and incorporated everything that I've experienced in travel in these three dishes has been incredible. And I, mean, I really want to compliment you that you took his memories of her Sara travel experience and you put it on a plate and you plated it so well. Yeah, and it's definite <laughs> that he's operating from a place of <laughs> all heart. Passion. I mean, thanks to you for challenging me to do all these things and the creativity comes out only when you challenge someone. Ah, uh, that's true. Wow. Oh. Thank you and thank you for thank having you me and hosting me. For being a part of this episode, we have something special courtesy Nair for you, our oh, wow. guest. I think flawless uh, eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> there has to be something for the wife as well. Oh yeah, yes. yes. <laughs> thank you so much. You're welcome. More than this, I think you deserve a hamper from my side. Thank you, thank you. And there's something about Italy, romance, and love stories. And truly, today we witnessed one, as I mentioned, on these plates. Thank you, Chef, for that. And I think this experience was unforgettable for Maradona, who found his love in Italy. True. And I think you will also not forget this love story. Yes, <laughs> I'm in love with the chef now. And I'm looking forward to many more experiences in the coming episodes. So stay with us and do join us in the next journeys. Till then, bye-bye. Till then, I'm going to have another one. <laughs>